Côte d'Azur, Monaco, the Laureus World Sports Awards. The Principality rolled out the red carpet for the best athletes and VIPs in the world. Welcome to the Laureus World Sports Awards 2018. It was set to be a magic night, including a new record. Roger Federer was crowned both Laureus World Sportsman and Comeback of the Year. This marked the fifth and sixth Laureus Awards won by the Swiss ace, a unique achievement. You know, I never thought that I was going to be coming back this strong, but it uh, makes the year so much more special. I think I was like a kid in the candy store, to be quite honest, when I started realizing what a special and great year it has been. So I feel very privileged to be here. The success of the Alpine nation was sealed by a second laureate. Paralympic athlete Marcel Hugues won the category for sports person with a disability. I just feel great happiness and and, and so thankful for this award. Um, it's it's so yeah great to to receive an award like this. The Mercedes AMG Formula One team took the top spot for the Laureus World Team of the Year category, beating Real Madrid amongst others. It's great because it has been the work of the team. It is not the work of a single individual, but it's 1,500 who have been deploying two cars. And insofar as it's the, the right trophy for this team. Above all, the social conscience is always at the centre of the event. This year's Laureus Sport for Good Award was given to Active Communities Network, an organisation changing the lives of young people in the UK, Ireland and South Africa. I think this uh, unique combination between the responsibility to can learn about in sports and the chance to get out of a difficult environment into a positive mood in your life is unique and fantastic and we are very glad that we can support many, many kids in this regard. This year awards were presented in 12 separate categories, an evening of entertainment and inspiration. The Laureus World Sports Awards a truly charismatic event.